Uh, oh, do I have to get up? I think I heard the mail plane landing. I better go get the mail. The mail plan- oh no, not one of these games with this weird textile for objective cart. What? Oh well, I missed it. Welcome to Alaska, where, uh, I don't know, something's gonna happen. <laughs> I saw this game, uh, it's called Alaska, it has a bunch of snow in it, <gasps> it has a map, which I have to hold in my hand, it looks like an open world game. Hang on, wait, 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 let's look that again, oh my gosh, that animation. Um, airstrip, Blake, Riggs, where the hell am I? Alright, well, press the action button. Oh, please don't be a horror game. There's a plane. Uh, because this house is, well, this guy is just so rem remote. Or, uh, this village, I guess. <laughs> Um, they get mail by the plane, so I don't know what kind of mail, it could just be one thing or it could just be a lot. How big is this place? Where am I? Oh god, what, Silk air Airstrip. Um, okay, I don't know where I am on the map. That's fine, is it, is it supposed to be the runway? Oh no it's not, okay. Hey man! Mason, how are you this morning? I couldn't be better, Blake. This morning really <laughs> does have that essence of greatness to it, doesn't it? That crisp air, that gorgeous sun. Days like this always remind me why I moved out here. Perfect. And how are you, my boy? I'm getting by. I know it's hard, Blake. I remember when my dear Ava left me. It took me months to get back to the happy man I am. Just keep your head high, your spirit strong, and everything will be all right, okay? Why don't you spend time with your neighbors? I know mine helped me. Thanks for your kind words, Mason. I'll keep them in mind. I've got to give everyone their mail anyway, so I might as well go see how everyone's doing. Thank you. Anytime, my friend. Just keep moving. We only die when we stop moving. Oh, wow. <laughs> um. Oh, he's very, um... Chipper, like who wrote this dialogue? Jeez, and the voice acting, whatever, whatever. That's, that's, I shouldn't be complaining. <laughs> it's a free game. Download link is in the description. It's based on Alaska, obviously. Uh, open world map. Cool. Oh, I'm in a stamina system. I can't, can't seem to go through the forest. I just run straight into the tree, and it's solid. Cool. You know. I do this weekly indie series because uh, I like finding new new types of games, new themes and atmospheric games and stuff. Atmospheric games, they aren't just limited to the AAA games. I mean, AAA game does a lot, but... Oh! See that? The plane just flew away. Alright, whatever. Say hello to the neighbor. Well, look who we have here. Every Monday for weeks you've been leaving our mail on the porch and not knocking to say hello like you normally do. It's very difficult explaining where someone is to a six-year-old, you know, especially when they only live ten steps away. Sorry, Anna. It's more like 14 steps, though, which makes all the difference. <laughs> it's okay. We were just happy to know you're still alive. You've had us all worrying. Come in to see Marcus and Jada. No, I, I was just delivering the mail. I want to go back to my warm cabin. Oh. What the hell? Those aren't in-game graphics. Wait. Oh. Blake! Why have you been hiding from me? Now why would I do a thing like that? Hide from my favorite person. I was looking for you too, you know. We just must not have crossed paths while we were looking. Okay, I guess that just about makes sense. You're forgiven. Is there anything in the mail for me? Only for Mommy and Daddy, I'm afraid. Aw, no fair. Don't worry. I'll make sure there is something in the mail for you next Monday, okay? Promise? Promise. <laughs> Thank you. Jeez. <laughs> 
Okay, what is this game about? Hey! How are you, old friend? Have you been getting the fish I've been leaving on your front porch? Yes, I have, thank you. A little dangerous yeah, what with the all hell? the bears and wolves out there, but thank you all the less. <laughs> well, I had to make sure you were alive somehow, didn't I? I loudly placed the fish on your porch, hid in some bushes, and watched you scramble outside well, to retrieve those the eyebrows? My life did. <laughs> <laughs> I really do appreciate it, Marcus. I know I haven't been around lately. Didn't want to pass my misery to anyone, you know? Ah, nonsense. That's why we're here. This community always sticks together, no matter what. We're always here for wagging your eyebrows. Us. Thank you. You know what? I've got a great idea. I'm about to go to the river and get the daily catch. Why don't you come with me? We can wash <laughs> all your worries away downstream. How about it? That sounds like a great idea. Perfect. I'll go get the boat and beers ready, and you just join me when you can. See you Wash all our worries down the stream. Who talks like this? Does everyone in Alaska talk like this? Bridge. Okay, I have to go to the bridge. Wait, 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 wait. So my name is Blake and Riggs, and they were talking about a community. Well, I guess it's Andrews, McWilliams, and Clarks. Okay, let's go to the bridge. Um, that would be outside of Riggs. Uh, this way. Cool. I'm liking this open world uh Unity engine game. Just a a free game. Oh, even though the voice acting and script is terrible, it is a bit of an adventure. They could have just made this a walking simulator, so you don't have much freedom, but uh, we'll see. Hang on, there's loading screens. Oh, birds. What is this place? I didn't expect birds in this type of game, but this is a bridge. Ah, oh, there he is. Hey. I usually row the boat upstream a little, just around the river bend. That's where I always find the big ones. So honestly, Blake. Stop just us two wagging your eyebrows. How are you Creep. really feeling, my friend? In all honesty, I feel a little lost. Like the whole world is passing me by, but I don't have what it takes to jump back on it anymore. Not without her, anyway. Come on, Blake. There's more to life than women. Easy for you to say. You have Anna and your lovely daughter. Hey, I understand. But I didn't always have them in my life. True. Look, I know it's hard now, but it'll get easier. You'll see. A few months down oh, the line, you'll even remember why you were upset. What was the real reason she left, anyway? She just couldn't handle the life out here. Not everyone can. Everyone's different, I guess. Some of us want this life. Living off the fat of the land. Fishing down rivers, Dude, your pants. creating your own heat from trees we've cut down, all while constantly surrounded by scenic views. Perfect. Some, though, they don't understand that. I'm guessing she went back to California? Of course, the Golden State. Very different from our state motto, the last frontier. Very different lifestyles indeed. It's no wonder she fled back. Why didn't she go back with her? She didn't want me to. It was just over. We'd been rocky for months prior. It would have only been a wasted effort. I understand. Right. Enough about the past. It's time to find what the future has in store for our stomachs. Grab the rod there, and we'll start. What rod? Fish oh, okay. <laughs> Great. This game has a fishing mini game. Oh, it might not be a mini game. This game might just be based off of it. Uh, oh my gosh, I have to time it with a green dot. Oh! Shut the hell up. Go on, Blake. You can do it. Oh, goddamn! What is this? Come on, Blake. I'll just keep spamming E. Fuck! Oh my god. Stop it, game! I'm pretty sure my dear oh, wife and daughter have passed away from starvation by now. Oh! Okay, got it! <laughs> oh, I can't fault the ambition, it's just... I don't know, it's weird seeing something like this. What now? Oh, I don't want to fish again, but I have to... 
Oh. Not gonna lie, Blake. I was worried we weren't gonna catch anything just then. <laughs> I think you need to get out more. It's been too long since you came out with me and Betty. Betty? Yeah. I decided to name the boat. It gave her more of a character. Someone I could talk to on long days out on the river. Hmm. I think it may be you that needs to get out more, Marcus. Right. I'll race you back to the house. Your fish is in the boat. Grab it and we'll go. My fish. <laughs> I hope you can help me with these, Marcus. Marcus? <gasps> Marcus! <laughs> what? <sighs> Marcus! Is that Marcus? <laughs> oh. <laughs>